Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to put one of these in your video. The subscribe button. Go ahead, click it. It actually works. Um, I'll show you how to make one and um, how to get it so you actually... No, don't worry. You will ask to be confirmed before you subscribe. Um, go ahead and click it. Even if you're already subscribed, go ahead and click that thing. I'll show you how to put one in. Hey guys, what's up? As I said, this um, video we are going to talk about how to add a subscribe button to your videos and how to make it actually work. So, first thing you need to do is you need to build your video. Now where I got the subscribe button from was I just did a Google search for subscribe YouTube subscribe button and I just saved the image and then what I had to do is make it a Photoshop image so that it saved the transparency or PNG file. So just to show you, I've got a web browser open here. Obviously Firefox. Subscribe button on YouTube is all I typed in. And I went to images and you see the subscribe button. Once I got that, I brought that image into Photoshop and I removed the white background. And I rendered out my video. Now, obviously, I can't show you with this video, but I'm going to show you with another video of mine on YouTube. So, we'll just go to YouTube here. And to save time, I'm going to pause the video and I'll come back to you guys when I get to that part. Ah. Okay, so I pulled up a video. This is my chroma key video that I did a while back. And uh, here's how you do it. Now, obviously, you would do this with like a subscribe button or something, or you would do this um, with something a little bit easier to do it with. But it doesn't matter where you do it in the video, where you are in the video. Just go to now. You have to be signed in to do this. You got to go to annotations. The video will load and you just pause it. Now you can see I already have some annotations here that I added in. I'm just going to create a new annotation and I'm going to create one that's called Spotlight. So we're going to create a Spotlight annotation. And I don't need any text, so I'm just going to delete that. And then what I did is I stretched it for the entire video. Or what I do is I stretch it to fit the subscribe button but in this case where I want the entire video to be a spotlight or subscribe button so let's just say I want this all to be a subscribe button so you select the area you want your hotspot, and you go to this little button right here, which is the link. And you see link type, it defaults to video, but if you just drop the list down, you'll see one that says subscribe. Now you just type in the name of the person that you want to subscribe to. I'm Chroma JT, and you can preview it, and all I do is I click save, and then all I have to do is just click publish or and the one last thing I forgot to do is you have to set the duration of the subscribe hotspot for however long you want it to be on screen I set for this example I'll set it for the entire thing save it and publish and now it's there in the video entire video 
So that's it, and I hope this was helpful, and have a great day.